हेलो वेलकम टू पार्ट थ्री ऑफ फिजियोथेरापी क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर एम सी क्यू सीरीज लेट्स मूव टू आवर फिफ्टी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच टाइप ऑफ गेट पैटर्न वुड बी मोस्ट अप्रोप्रिएट फॉर पेशेंट हु एक्सिबिट यूनिलैटरल लोअर एक्सट्रीमिटी वीकनेस ऑप्शन ए फोर पॉइंट गेट ऑप्शन बी टू पॉइंट गेट ऑप्शन सी थ्री पॉइंट गेट ऑप्शन डी स्विंग थ्रो एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी थ्री पॉइंट गेट Moving to our 52nd question, a uniform resistance at all point of range during relaxed passive movement is known as dash passivity. Option A, clasp knife. Option B, lead pipe. Option C, cog wheel. Option D, all of the above. And the answer is option B, lead pipe. Moving to our 53rd question, deep tendon reflex is exaggerated in lesion. Option A, upper motor neuron. Option B, lower motor neuron. Option C, peripheral nerve injury. Option D, none of the above. And the answer is option A, upper motor neuron. Moving to a fifty-fourth question, Dugas test is diagnostic of option A, anterior dislocation of the shoulder. Option B, scaphoid fracture. Option C, fracture of neck or femur. Option D, dislocation of hip. And the answer is option A, anterior dislocation of the shoulder. Moving to a fifty-fifth question, the crystal deposited in the joint in Gorty arthritis is option A, calcium pyrophosphate. Option B, calcium oxalate. Option C, monosodium urate crystals. Option D, disodium urate. And the answer is. Option C, monosodium urate crystals. Moving to our fifty-sixth question, knee flexion in prone lying is an example of dash. Option A, first order lever. Option B, second order lever. Option C, third order lever. And the answer is option C, third order lever. Moving to a fifty-seventh question, muscle is most efficient in dash range. Option A, outer. Option B, outer part of the middle. Option C, inner. Option D, inner part of the middle. And the answer is option B, outer part of the middle. Moving to our fifty-eighth question, name the intercapsular knee ligament of knee joint. Option A. tibial collateral ligament option b anterior cruciate ligament option c fibula collateral ligament option d ligamentum patellae and the answer is option b anterior cruciate ligament moving to a 59th question crude maneuver is when there is option a automatic bladder option b autonomous bladder option c detrusor sprinter option d flaccid sprinter and spastic detrusor and the answer is option b autonomous bladder moving to our 60th question teddy thomas sign is related with Option A scaphoid dislocation option B perilunate dislocation option C perilunate dislocation with associated tricuspid dislocation mid carpal option D lunate dislocation and the answer is option A scaphoid lunate dislocation moving to our 61st question ETOIMS stands for option A electrical treatment option for intramuscular stimulation option B electrical twitch obtaining intramuscular stimulation option C electrical twitch observed on intramuscular stimulation option D none of the above and the answer is option B electrical twitch obtaining intramuscular stimulation Moving to our sixty-second question, rule of nine is used in assessing option A area of burns, option B severity of psoriasis, option D scarring brain injury, option D weakness in the spine injury, and the answer is option A area of burns. Moving to our sixty-third question, rear base is 
ऑप्शन ए मैक्सिमम टॉलरेबल करंट फॉर ए नर्व इम्पल्स एट लॉन्ग ड्यूरेशन ऑप्शन बी मिनिमम करंट फॉर नर्व इम्पल्स एट शॉर्ट ड्यूरेशन ऑप्शन सी मिनिमम करंट फॉर नर्व इम्पल्स एट लॉन्ग ड्यूरेशन ऑप्शन डी नन ऑफ द अबाउ एंड द आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी मिनिमम करंट फॉर नर्व इम्पल्स एट लॉन्ग ड्यूरेशन मूविंग टू आवर सिक्सटी फोर्थ क्वेश्चन Asia grading is used in option A traumatic brain injury option B traumatic spinal cord injury option C traumatic hip injury option D traumatic shoulder injury and the answer is option B traumatic spinal cord injury moving to our 65th question the upper and middle trunk of the brachial plexus combine to form the dash cord Option A lateral option B posterior option C medial option D anterior and the answer is option A lateral moving to our 66th question the unit of ultrasound is option A watts option B watts per centimeter square option C volt square inch option D newton and the answer is option b watts per centimeter square moving to our 67th question angle of lewis corresponds to option a t2 to t3 spine option b t4 to t5 spine option c t6 to t7 spine option d none of this and the answer is option b t4 to t5 spine moving to our 68th question mostly uvr is absorbed in option a epidermis option b dermis option c subcutaneous tissue option d capillary loop and the answer is option a epidermis moving to our 69th question excessive formation of substance or secretion in the body is controlled in order to maintain hemostasis by option a positive feedback mechanism option b negative feedback mechanism option c osmosis option d hemodynamics and the answer is option b negative feedback mechanism moving to our 70th question depolarization of ventricles begins from option a posterior lateral area of the left ventricle option b base of the left ventricle option c left part of the septum option d right part of the septum and the answer is option c left part of the septum moving to our 71st question froman's test is done for dash option a intrinsic muscle option b abductor pollicis brevis option c adductor pollicis brevis option d opponens pollicis and the answer is option c adductor pollicis moving to our 72nd question groove below the cuboid bone is for the tendon of option a tibialis anterior option b tibialis posterior option c peroneus longus option d peroneus brevis and the answer is option c peroneus longus moving to our 73rd question intercalated disc is present in option a smooth muscle option b skeletal muscle option c cardiac muscle option d none of the above and the answer is option c cardiac muscle moving to our 74th question for a patient having foot drop the orthosis recommended is option a knee angle foot orthosis option b hip knee angle foot orthosis option c hip or foot orthosis option d angle foot orthosis and the answer is option d angle foot orthosis moving to our 75th question composite bone matrix strength is due to option a phosphate option b calcium hydroxy papitate option c osteocalcin option d collagen and the answer is option b calcium hydroxy papitate so that's all for today if you need further clarification check the description box and give your feedback in the comment box 
If you like this MCQ session, do subscribe to this channel for more videos. Thank you.